Hey, what is going on guys? It's Brody of Brokemon. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Y solo run. Today we're going to be going and catching Eveltal. And then not only that, we're also going to be battling the 8th gym hopefully because we just need to get on with this game here. So you better have come prepared, both you and your Pokemon. Right on, bud. So yeah, that is the objective today. I'm, I guarantee we're getting Eveltal. I will be using my Master Ball on it just because I don't want to waste time trying to throw Ultra Balls at it. And then later on I can just go and get myself freaking what's its name? Xerneas and those... Not Xerneas, I can't even get Xerneas. Oh my god, I forgot its name. Zygarde, there we go. I can, I can go get those off screen like after the series is done. So let's do this. Manetric fainted, that's right. You expect to live? Well, you can't, I'm sorry. Alright, Scrafty. So the Pokemon we're coming up against now are, you know, like Team Flare usually has. Dark types. I don't know why I just used that attack. The Scrafty's gonna eat that up. Yep, told you. Told you, I know a lot about Scrafty, I know. <laughs> but yeah. Alrighty. For some reason on my uh, capture card, so like my... Uh, my 3DS capture software, all the in, all the like menu options are in like Japanese. Oh crap, it is a switch Pokemon. Can't do that. We are not allowed to switch Pokemon. Alright, we're just gonna go for a crunch on this Golbat. Yeah, for some reason all the uh, all the stuff is in is in freaking Japanese. Alright. I'm pretty sure like last episode as well, I did really bad math. I was saying they're catching up in levels because they were like mid 40s and stuff. I'm actually like 22 levels ahead of these things, so <laughs> that's a little bit crazy. I mean, I don't know, I can't remember exactly what I said, but I'm pretty sure I was like, man, I'm only 12 levels higher now, but uh, I think I was actually like 22 levels higher. Anyways, let's get in here. Let's get in. All right. Where are we going? Going for a nice drop. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> What the heck? I don't even know. I'm sorry. All right. Now we proceed in here and we talk to this guy. All right. What do you have to say, man? He's looking at that ultimate weapon from here. I can see it. The ultimate weapon's flower has finally bloomed above the soil. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we know it has. But there's something inside that cell at the bottom that's powering this ultimate weapon. So. We need to, I know I'm skipping through the text, I just, there's a few battles that you have to do, like quite a few actually. Oh, he's crying. He's crying, I don't know why. Pussy! Fucking pussy! We're battling him right now? Okay, I guess so. <laughs> I forgot completely about this. But yeah, there are a couple, like, you have to literally battle all of Team Flare's admins on your way down there, so. I'm just trying to get through this as quick as possible so that we can get to our uh, the next point in the game. That's what we're doing. So we're going to Outrage. I don't know why I used Outrage. What am I thinking? Why did I just do that? Now I'm going to be confused. Crap. Alright, what we're going to do... Okay, at least, you know, Gyarados, an Outrage would be useful against the Gyarados. Because I think we can probably one-shot it now. So outrage here to do the trick. Come on. No, it lived. And it's using outrage. Oh no. <laughs> Come on, Garchomp, dang it. Yes. All right, but now we're confused. We have low health. This is not good. This is not good. Oh no, I don't think we're confused. Yes, we're not. All right, cool. All right, Pyro, we have to keep battling. We're locked into Outrage still. This is not, this is not the best uh, situation right now. Oh man, because we're at like half health. That Gyarados took a massive chunk out of us there. Wow. Okay. All right. I'm really nervous for the Mega Gyarados because I know he Mega evolves that Gyarados the next time we'll battle him. So. Come on, escape this confusion, you can do it, man! Yes! Yes! I knew we had faith in Garchomp. I knew we could do it. That's right. That is right. Alrighty, so we beat Lissandra, no problemo. 
It was a bit worrying though, I was honestly a bit scared. <laughs> that Gar that uh, Gyarados took out a massive chunk of my health. Alright, so now we're going to head on down and battle every admin, which this is uh, this is an annoying little part, but uh, you know, it has to be done. Alrighty, let's do this. So what do we got first? I'm afraid you're gonna have to turn back. Alright, that's fine. If that's what you think I should do, we'll just prove you wrong. At least we have a partner here who can battle alongside us. That's, uh, that's great. But he's using a lie part. Literally one oh no, that's them. Never mind. I was uh, I don't know how I freaking thought that was her. She always leads with her meow stick. Extremely under leveled meow stick at that. So what we're gonna do here is we're going to iron head the lie part, and then hopefully what that will end up doing is getting meow stick able to psychic that uh, thing, and we can just both one shot a Pokemon. So hopefully she uses psychic here. She did get hit by sucker punch, meaning she did use an attacking move, and yeah, she uses the psychic. Which is perfect. Knocks out that Toxic Croak instantly. Because he's four times weak to it, obviously. There we go. There we go, that's right. There we go. There we go. Alright, let's let's go. I don't care if you have anything to say to me. We don't care about it. I'm going to use just like a super potion just in case. I want this put here, actually. There we go. Let's use a super potion. We'll actually use two of them. Just so we can gain some exper uh, experience, HP back, in case we get in a bad situation. Yeah, you just keep running and talking behind me, I don't care. Let's battle. Is this another double battle? Is this another one? Yes, it is. Alrighty. Alrighty. Okay, she has a level 50 Manetric, so this thing is a little bit... Sorry about that moment of silence too, by the way, guys. I, uh, I'm i trying to send like a text message. <laughs> I know, why is bro at Brokemon, sorry. Why is Brokemon texting when he's doing a video? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to at all. Why does her Pokemon get fully restored? Why don't you fully restore my Pokemon as well? That'd be very nice. Alright. Oh no, we got paralyzed. No. Okay, so we at least oh there you go, a nice super effective hit on Mightyena, which probably won't do very much anyways, but oh well. And you got hit by the stab assurance, but it's a Mightyena, so we're okay. Uh, let's go for the um, let's just go for Crunch. I know it's not very effective, but with this attack from Meow Stick, we should probably be able to knock it out here with a Crunch. So that's going to use Assurance, knock out the Meow Stick, but hopefully our not very effective attack will do the job. <clears throat> Come on. Come on, yes. Not bad. Garchomp's power is real. Oh, we're nearly level 69. Oh, oh. Okay. Not bad. So, let's actually recover from that uh, paralysis. We don't want to be paralyzed. So that just makes us slower than everyone, even though we already have a billion attack. We don't want that, do we? No, we don't. All right, Bow, Serena. Oh my lord. All right, we're gonna. This girl just wants to tag along. There she is with her nice short, 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 short skirt, and we're gonna let her come with us. All right, yeah. Follow behind, woman. We're going to keep going here. All the way down the stairs to the next admin who is just freaking annoying. So yeah, you come on ahead and uh, step right up, step right up. These guys are just annoying. I don't know why they're all just standing here. They're just being an annoying little shits. Oh, please use disarming voice. Like if you have any brains in that head of yours, you would use disarming voice. We're gonna use dig on the hound doom. And that will easily one-shot that, but if she uses Disarming Voice on that Scrafty, that'll be perfect. Oh, it, oh, it hits both, okay. Okay, never mind, so because it hits both, it's not really going to do that much. But yeah, there we go, we get the Houndoom out of here, and if she uses another Disarming Voice, it should almost take out that Scrafty. I don't think it quite will, because 
Scrafty's really bulky, and Meowstic isn't the best, so... Level 69, let's go. <laughs> let's go, level 69, right on. Disarming boys, come on, hopefully this uh, does a good amount. Not really that much, but oh well. We're still gonna be able to outspeed a Scrafty, even though, he, okay, he didn't target me at all, so. We are good to go, we're just gonna hit him up with the iron head. We're gonna make our head turn into steel. And uh, knock him out, that's what we do. That's how we roll, dog. That's how we roll. Right on. And so now, we got to keep going because these guys are just gonna keep standing in our way. I don't know where the hell, what her, whatever her name is, my girl. Where's my girl? She said she wanted to tag along. She's not even here. Yes, thank you for telling me we have to hurry. That's what I've been trying to do this whole time. All right, we made it to the bottom at least and all of a sudden, freaking what's her name caught up. Completely forgot her name. This might help. It's a device that helps you solve a puzzle. Claymon gave it to me. Thank God for that nerd. That nerd helped us out. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's head on through here. We do not have time to, to diddle daddle. Dilly dally. <laughs> diddle daddle. <laughs> Alrighty, so here is the, the, the power cell for the mighty weapon of strength and frickin' destruction. So... We need to uh, kind of take it out here, but all of a sudden, a billion people pop up, and we're gonna have to battle all of them. Just kidding. We don't have to battle all of them. I, th I think we don't. All right. Yeah, we have to battle four people. Yes, I think I can beat all of you. <laughs> don't even worry about it. I can beat all of you, no problem. Team Flyer Admin, Lipard. Like, this is not going to be a challenge at all. Because you have a Lipard. Just for that single reason, this will be easy. Iron Heads knock out Lipards every day. Especially when we're 22 levels higher. <laughs> wow, not bad. And then Manectric. So, if this thing hits us up with the static, that's going to suck. That is going to majorly suck. So hopefully uh, you decide to chill with your ability and uh, yeah, that's right. Roar would have been annoying to keep having to switch out our Pokemon. No, I... Rick. Alright, I think we have something to cure the paralysis, if not shit. <laughs> We're kind of, in, uh, kind of in a bad position here. Alright. So now, what we have to do... At least we can heal. Like, if they made us go back to back, that would suck. So hopefully we have a berry that can deal with that. I don't think we have one. Shit. Do we have a full heal? We do not have a full heal. All we have is a full restore. And at this point, we really don't have a choice. Oh, man. Oh, well, at least we have a shit ton of money. I can go buy a bunch of full restores after. I should have probably stocked up on full heals. Now that I think about it, or like... Just get some more paralysis heals. We got a swallow lot, so this thing will go down to a dig, no problem. No problemo. That is uh, what we're gonna go with here, dig. We're running a little bit low on digs, but we do have a max ether loaded up, just in case, so if we need more digs, we can definitely grab some of those. Hit them up, hit them up, hit them up, yeah. Hit them up with the dig. Hit him up. I'm really nervous about the Mega Gyarados. I am not even lying right now. Because it's gonna Mega Evolve turn one, right? And when it Mega Evolves, it becomes Dark type, which means it will resist our Crunch. Mega Evolution has priority, therefore his Crunch, oh not Crunch, therefore he will become Dark type before we, uh, he'll become Dark type before we can use Crunch and get neutral damage off. So. I think what I'm going to do is use Dig a first turn against that thing because I know it's going to kind of screw us up for the rest of the battle because it is going to use, it's going to have Intimidate or whatever. So oh man, this is not going to be fun. <laughs> Alright, all right. I don't know if you guys noticed a cut but uh, as per usual I got interrupted, I'm actually home alone right now. The phone rang, it was my mom, I had to go do a couple of chores. So there'll probably be another interruption later on in the video. 
because I'll have to tell my mom when she walks in the door that I'm still recording. So, <laughs> yeah. Oh man. That's the struggle of having to record really long episodes because things are gonna happen in your life and uh, they happen when you're recording. You just gotta deal with it. So I have a bit of editing to do, which I don't, I don't honestly mind that much. It's just a little bit annoying. Oh well, it's all good. All right, let's go for the crunch, the crunch. <laughs> Everyone's gonna notice crunch. Nah, it's not gonna catch on. Wow, this thing actually lived. I think, I think it'll die now though because of my rough skin. Yes, sir. Get out. That's right. Level 70, not even bad. Not even bad. We are pushing that 300 attack as well, which is always fine and dandy. We need all the freaking attack we can get when we're about to fight this Mega Gyarados, which I'm really nervous for. All right. Now. Arr. Arr, 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 We back up, but there's nothing we can do. Who could it be? Spawning from that thing. It's starting to explode. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> what am I doing? And boom. Eveltal. The most badass looking mofo. I don't know about you guys, this thing just looks way more freaking badass than Xerneas. I don't know, Xerneas is cool, but Eveltal just looks like it is the most dangerous thing. You would not want to fuck with this thing. You would not. Don't tell me you would. Because I know you wouldn't. Yes, Eveltal, the nice powerful destruction Pokemon. So, now what we have to do here is use our Master Ball. Right on. Master Ball it up. Master Ball. We're going to use that Master Ball. Because we don't have time. <laughs> we don't have time. Master Ball. All right. Shake that uh, for me. Shake that uh, for me. Boom. Is it just me, or whenever you guys throw a Master Ball, are you always just a little bit worried that it'll break open? I'm always a little bit worried about it. So, we're gonna have to nickname Eveltal, and who is it gonna be? We are gonna name you Master, in honor of Poke Master Walkthrough. I wasn't exactly sure what I would nickname it, so I just went with Master. So there you go, bud. We caught it. What a starting development. All right, here comes this freaking weird ass guy now. Using that same invention. I don't, like, what is that thing on his back? I don't know what that is. All right, so now he's gonna mega evolve. And uh, yeah. I hope I didn't click yes to adding Eveltal to my party. Cause I think I might have by accident, which would be very bad. It would be very bad if we did. Oh yeah, we accidentally added him to our party. Oops. Oopsies. <laughs> All right, do we have any, we can't even use attacks that are like, not, okay, yeah, we're gonna switch out. Shit, this is gonna be a free attack on Garchomp. We're level 70 though, I mean, oh man, come on. There we go, Garchomp, get out there. This thing just used Swords Dance. We are not fucking letting this thing attack us. All right, let's use Dig here. Because I know Dig's gonna one-shot it. I don't want to lock myself into an Outrage right now. It just missed the high jump kick, and now it's gonna die. Excellent. Thank God. Thank God we're freaking level 70. Oh, man. All right. Now who's next? Pyroar. We're gonna keep battling against this Pyroar. And we're just gonna go for another Dig. We are going for another one. Let's go. All right, so this will easily one-shot a Pyroar as well. And yeah, dig. 
Dig it up. D -d Dig it up. Hey. There we go. Another one down. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> Hunch crow. Alright, he's saving his mega evolution for last. I see you, bud. So we're gonna go for the iron head. Because I'm not locking myself in our rage. Oh, yes. Iron head one shotted it. Not even bad. I thought it was gonna be a two hit. Okay. Here's the tough. Oh my god. We have to uh, keep battling here. Got a nice Gyarados Intimidate hitting us up. So we're going to go for the dig because I know that it is um, going to Mega Evolve right away. So yeah, now it's not Flying type anymore. It's Water and Dark. We don't have anything super effective against this thing. Man, I'm nervous. This thing might... <laughs> this thing can hit us so hard if it uses Outrage. Yes, it just used Outrage. It is not fucking around right now. Alright, we lowered it big time. It's gonna use the Outrage. Come on, Garchomp, tank this! Tank it! Yes! Rough skin. Alright, now what we have to do is go for Outrage of our own. Outrage. Boys, we did it! <laughs> we took out the Mega Gyarados. It only took us 17 extra levels to do it, but we did it alright. Yes. Throw those glasses on the flow. That's right. That's exactly right. Sweet. Sweet. So a victory, yeah. Wog. That's exactly what I say when I get defeated. <laughs> Alright. Alrighty. Okay, we just gotta skip all this, skip all that. Yeah, foolish humans. You're gonna ruin the world. Whatever. He's gonna destroy the whole planet now. Let's get out of here. He's self he's he's killing himself. If you guys don't actually know what happens here, he actually ends up destroying himself. So going out with a bang at least. I'm sorry that I had to get end this way, man, but uh, you just got your uh, so humiliated. You just got so humiliated that you had to do this. So he's firing that weapon into space. It's gonna curve on back down. And, uh, unfortunately for him, that is the end. So, I, I really want to know where we were that allowed us to survive this. That's what I want to know. Houses got knocked over, this thing exploded in a fiery burst of death. Where exactly were we when this all happened that allowed us to survive that? Because right here, you will see that we are all right back. <laughs> All right back at the surface, so I really want to know where we made it. Like, how we got out of there. Alrighty. Yes, here's the mass heroes of you 2 Alright. Yes, Anister City, you guys head over there. Thank you, Bows. I have so much respect for you as a friend. Thanks, fam. Alrighty, so... Now we got this big AZ guy. A long, a long time ago, a very long time ago. You're looking in that pit. Yeah, see this guy is just letting us know here that he is that man who made that weapon. And he feels bad for it. Yes. Bye, AZ. Bye. Alright, now we need to switch Master out of the first spot here. Sorry about that, Master. Anyways, uh, what am I doing? We should fly to Anister City, because that's where everyone was talking about going. So fly me to the moon. Kuramin, where's Anastar City? Santa Loon, Snowbell, Kuriway. Pretty sure we're supposed to go to Anastar City. Like that's what everyone was saying, right? Camphrier, Silage, Ambret, Kuramin, Sea Spirits Den, Shalur, Geosange, Silage. Ambret. I'm going over the same cities I've already been over. Dendamil. There we go. We're gonna head over here. So that's where everyone was saying, meet me there. So, I don't know. That's where we're going, though. That's where we going, though. Alright, where is everybody at? Where they at, though? Where they at? Are they going to be here? 
Are you gonna- no, they're not here. Okay, maybe we didn't even have to come here. Maybe they were just like saying that as a fun fact. Like, hey, we're going to Anastar City. So what we're gonna do now is fly. We're gonna fly like an eagle. All right, we're gonna head south. We don't actually have to fly. We're already in the city at the end of where we should be. So let's head on out. We're gonna go to the Pokemon Center real quick. Gonna heal up. Because I know we have a bit of damage on us. So I'm not exactly sure if we're actually gonna be able to fight this gym today. Which sucks. Because I really wanna get through this game. <laughs> we might have to do a double upload day, boys. We might have to. We might have to do it. Because I'm getting nervous that we won't finish this game in time. So I think what we'll do is, uh... Oh, we got a holoclip. What is it? What do you have to say? Do you have a minute? I'd like to talk to you face to face. Let's meet in Kuriway Town. Okay, we'll head over there. So yeah, guys, I think what we're gonna do is... We're gonna have a double upload day. Which will be fun stuff. Fun stuff. So where is Kuriway? I think it's over here. Dendamil, Lavier, Kuramin, Shalur, Geosenge, Silage, Ambret, Camphrier, Santaloon. Uh, where the hell is it? Where's Kuriway? The hell, man. There is no Kuriway. I really need to know what. I like. I need to find this. Silage, Connecting Cave. Santaloon. Where's Kuriway, man? Is it down here? Oh my god, are you serious? You li <laughs> made it sound like I had to go somewhere else. I was already heading there. Dick. So yeah, tomorrow you will be seeing two videos from me. Whoa. So I better start recording that. Because <laughs> I don't have I don't have much time, do I? Head on down to Corey Way Town. Hey! Alright, youngster Jaden. See, why couldn't youngster Jaden help defeat Team Flare? If he's all the way over here, that means his Pokemon are like level 50 about that. Like, yeah, almost level 50. Yet, I'm still the one who has to take on everything by myself. I had a double battle with what's her name? Serena. Twice. That's her contribution. Oh, we got poison. Are you shitting me right now? They just jelly about my swag. They just jelly. Alright. What now? Pincer. Keep battling. We're gonna have to use an antidote. At least we have an antidote, right? Am I right? I'm right? Right? This thing will be uh, not surviving that, so no problem there. Okay. That should level us up, actually, too, because I know pincers give a pretty solid amount of experience. So, yeah. Here we go, level 71 now. Not bad. Better use this antidote though, I don't want to stay poisoned. Being poisoned is never a good experience. Never. So we are going to use... Whatever, uh, where is it? Super, super potion, <laughs> what? Okay, there we go. Now we are cured of our poison. We can get on over here. Got a hyper potion too, that's pretty good. I'll be helpful if we ever need it. When we're battling against the Elite Four. Alright, so we can actually head on south this way. South, why am I saying south? Because it is south, that's why. Got a nice Torkoal here. Nice and fresh. Nice and fresh. Alright, let's get out of there. Not ha we don't have time to battle you, sorry Torkoal. But we're gonna go over here now. We got a battle though. We need to get out of here fast. I mean, we don't have the time to deal with this. Don't have the time. If this thing is level 49, we've taken you out before. Exactly the same kind. Oh no, level 52. There we go. You're getting up there in the levels now. Sorry about this, by the way. I mean, I like you, Mian Chao, but it's just time that you got uh, outraged on. Bye bye. Bye bye. We're almost getting 3,000 experience from Pokemon that we knock out now, which is super cool. We're almost at a level 100 Garchomp. And by almost, I mean 30 levels. <laughs> Alright. Well, what the heck? 
I wasn't expecting a visitor. What? No. I don't want to have an inverse battle. Why, why would I have fun doing that? That isn't fun. When it comes to climbing, you can ascend or descend. What do you prefer? Well, I've actually gone mountain climbing before. And let me tell you, descending sucks. I'd much rather ascend. <laughs> Ooh, we got a stunk fist. Stun fisk or whatever they're called. Stun fisk, yeah, that's what you are. We wanna use dig. These things are really weird. <laughs> I don't even think they're good either. Like what what the hell is that? What what is the purpose of this thing existing? A nice ground and electric type though, that is unique at least. But you still suck. So bye bye. I don't know why anyone would use that thing. There's many better ground types, there's many better uh, electric types. Okay, can we please just get to our city? No. We can't even sky battle unless we use Eveltal, I'm sorry. It's not what we do here. I'm gonna roller skate on this thing. Cause I don't give a shit. Okay, we're gonna use a rappel, just so we can get into the city here. Um... I'm sure you guys can probably hear a bit of like urgency in my voice because I am just trying to get through this game. It'd be a lot better if I if I actually got my 3DS like on time. This would not be a stressful moment. Do you want to battle? Yeah, you do. Why did I talk to you? Like, yeah. If I wouldn't have gotten my 3DS super late, I would have been okay. Because what ended up happening was the company was actually late on shipments, so they could not. They could not send it on time, so I got got it a little late. But at least it like when they actually shipped it from Japan. By the way, they ship it from Japan. It got here in two days, two or three days. I can't remember, but like that is pretty solid. Like props to that company for getting it here so quickly after they shipped it. All right, Iron Head should knock this thing out in one hit. There we go. Not bad at all. Now we can just keep going. We can get out of here. Okay, now get out of my face. All right, I think we're here. Yes, we are. Awesome. So let's go into here and get ourselves a bit more HP and we'll go talk to the Professor Sycamore. Mm, excuse me, and then we will end the episode. I forgot how much extra stuff there was in between the seventh and eighth gym in this game. That's why I was like, oh, I can do them both in one episode, when clearly that was just not happening. So, where is Professor Sycamore? He is not here, but there's an item here. Ooh, a rare candy, so now we have two free levels on our Garchomp. Before we fight the Elite Four, we can use those. Where could he be? Where could Professor Sycamore be? Don't you dare hide from me now. Don't need you right now. Maybe he's in here. He is not in here. Why aren't you there, Professor? Hello. Okay, maybe here he is. There we go. I have to apologize to you about Lissandra. Very sorry for the trouble he caused. And I also like to thank you. You saved the world. He's French though. And maybe someday the population of people and Pokemon will actually cease to whatever. Okay. Okay. Now I'm gonna end this episode after we freaking battle him. Him. Because he likes making me battle him. He has a Venusaur. Why? Why do you have a Venusaur? Okay. Hold on, I have to pause this for a sec so I can say I'm recording. Alright, there we go, we're back and we can finish this off here, so. Let's KO this fool. There we go, that should uh, do the trick. It did. Sure did. Now... We will keep battling here. And I don't know how you still have a Blastoise, I took your Squirtle. I own Andreas, how do you even have a Blastoise? Doesn't matter. <laughs> Outrage is just gonna one-shot everything. And we're level 72 now. Sweet. Maybe we'll be level 80 by the time we get to the Elite Four. With these two rare candies we have, I mean, it's possible. 
And that would be actually really great. I think level 80 is, uh, is a reasonable goal. There we go, we knocked out his three Pokemon. Easy peasy. Alrighty, thank you very much. He's just like, you really are something. Yes, I am. I saved the world. That's right. Alrighty. Alright, yeah, okay. Thank you, I know. Okay, so that's gonna do it, guys, for this episode. Thank you for watching. I gotta get some more recorded because I have a double up upload tomorrow. So be on the lookout for that. I'll see you guys later, and peace out.